In a body shop, your boss would say, we got some rust to fix right here, and the same on the other side. No fancy tools, no aftermarket patch panels, no brand new sheet metal. You'd have to scavenge some metal off an old scrap hood and form it by hand. So today, we're going to take a look at just how to do that. First, we'll cut away all the rust. After preparing the area and finding some sheet metal that's large enough, we can begin forming the patch. Now we're just going to curve it. Just make it round. Like that panel. And you really can't mess this up. You're just making it round. You just get it close and then go try it. That's what it looks like so far. I think we need a little more. I think I think that'll do it. And I'm going to trim this off right here so that I have like one quarter to one half of an inch overlap all the way around the patch. Now we're just going to match this line right here and draw that right on the patch just like that and then we're going to bend it over eh, maybe about a half inch so once we pull this off we can draw this line down like that and then we'll bend it right here around this. It has to bend around that. And we'll get that a little bit straightened up and then just weld those slots up. 
Before welding, here's a shot of that patch panel clamped into place. One thing to keep in mind while welding is that it's not always going to be perfect and there's nothing to worry about if a few welds are bad. Your body work has to be perfect, but not necessarily your welds. And to keep it steady, I like to anchor my hand right here and then hold on to the thing. You can also put the welder right against the, the cone right against the work. Before we clamp the patch into place, here's a quick shot of a few of my favorite vice grips for welding. I hope this video on making your own patch panels without any special tools helps you out in some way. If it did, and you'd like to get my latest videos, don't forget to hit the subscribe button.